Heroes and heroines of all ages. When the world tells you to get a life, you're always welcome at the 1UP block. And my name is Dan the Man, your host, and today we're in Helia. Lake Helia. I was about to say Helia Forest, but this is totally a forest. What are you talking about? We're still continuing on from where I left off last time. And last time I went to Zora's Domain, even though I was supposed to come here first. But uh, luckily for me, as I started recording, I noticed something. And I'll, I'll show you where it is in a minute, but, uh, see, we, we actually needed to go to Zora's Domain first because th it's the only way we could reach this, uh, this little jar down here. And what's in the jar, you may be asking yourself? I think it's an extra bottle, too. You got an empty bottle, but put something in it. Wait, what? Something's already inside? <laughs> that's kind of funny, actually. Let's get up here. Swim, 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 swim. Alright, so now we can go to the start menu. Lag into it. Pick this. Do we get to read the note? I think it's a special item. Huh? It looks like there is something already inside this bottle. It's a letter. Help me, I'm waiting for you inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly, Rudo. P.S. Don't tell my father. <laughs> <laughs> well... The only way to reach you, my dear, is to tell your father. But, check it out. See that little hole down there? If you didn't already notice it? Well, guess what I can do now that I have the silver scale? I can go inside of it. And guess where it leads us? Directly back into Zora's domain. Yeah! Yeah, for shortcuts! But, uh, yeah, now we can go, uh talk to Rudo's dad, who is the king, and we can finally get inside of wherever the fuck is behind him, because that's where we're going. Listen to me talking as if you don't know what's behind him, because uh, I'm trying not to give you spoilers. <laughs> spoilers on an old ass game. What is this madness? Alright, but we stand here and give him the letter. Oh, this letter, it's from Princess Rudo. Hmm, let's see. She's inside Lord Jabu Jabu? That's not possible. Our guardian god, Lord Jabu Jabu, would never eat my dear Princess Rudo. But since that stranger Ganondorf came here, Lord Jabu Jabu has been acting... Shut up, phone. Has been a little green around the gills. The evidence seems clear, of course. You'll go find Rudo. You can pass through here to the altar of Jabu Jabu. Lord Jabu Jabu. I'll keep this letter. You keep the bottle it was in. Take it respectfully. Please find my dear Princess Rudo immediately. Zora! Why do you say Zora? <laughs> God damn, take forever, why don't you, King? <laughs> this is taking far too long, but at least he makes a stupid ass sound. <laughs> Come on, fat ass! I need to go! We've got things to do, people to see. People to do, things to see. Whatever your agenda is for the night. But yes, now we can get behind old douchebag here. So, first of all, before we do anything, I need to take out my handy dandy fish. And we're gonna roll on this way. I'm glad I did this faster than I thought I would, because, like I said, I usually get stuck at this part. But, things went a little smoother than I thought they would, so that's good. I like that. And, uh, basically, this is Lord Jabu Jabu, and this is the palace, or whatever the fudge. So, uh, don't distort Lord Jabu Jabu, King Zora, the whatever that number is, I can't read Roman numerals. Sorry, I'm not that intelligent, but, uh... Yeah, Lord Jabu Jabu is just chilling there. He doesn't really do much. He kind of blinks, maybe? Yeah, he does blink in a weird way. You can touch his lips, you can cut his lips, and he makes some sort of metal sound for some reason. Yeah, whatever. Alright, but all you have to do is stand here and drop a fish. And guess what happens next? Oh, you won't even know. Sorry, I took a swig of coke. <laughs> he opens his mouth and totally whale sucks us in, Pinocchio style. Run, Link, run! No! Gulp. Nom 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 nom. Gulp. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. 
inside Jabu Jabu's belly. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the th to the third dungeon in the game, Jabu Jabu's belly. Uh, this place is kind of re retarded. I hate this place, this part especially. I can't block shots because I no longer have a shield, and I forgot to go get one. All right, so to get in there, we're gonna have to. Please don't shoot me from here. We're gonna have to shoot his little uh, dangly dangly. His uh, uterus. <laughs> Anybody see Monster House? Yeah, me neither. Who, who saw that movie? <laughs> no, but seriously. Uh, what we're gonna have to do is... We're just gonna go this way for now. This, this dungeon always gets me so confused. Even though it's really... Like, after I played it for the first time and for... Oh, shit. Hello, fish titties. Instead of bitch titty, it's fish titty. You, who are you? I'm bitch titty. <laughs> Princess of the Zoras. What, are you saying my father asked you to come here to save me? I'd never ask anyone to do such a thing. Letter in a bottle? I have no idea what you're talking about. My father is worried about me. I don't care. Anyway, I can't go home right now, and you, get out of here, you understand? Yeah, she's... Ugh, oh, you idiot. There she goes. Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> yeah, she's uh, kind of a bitch. She's kind of an idiot. So, uh, we're gonna go help her out. Hey there, Queenie. Oh, what the hell? Ah, that hurt. I don't know how to kill the jellyfish, actually, but whatever. Are you still hanging around here? I told you to go away. I'm okay. I've been going inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly since I was little, but Lord Jabu Jabu is very strange today. There are electrified jellyfish in strange holes all around. On top of that, my precious stone was... But that's none of your business. Anyway, you, go home now. You understand? No, I'm not going home. You are that worried about me? Then I will give you the honor of carrying me. However, I won't leave you until I find the thing I'm looking for. You would better believe me. Yeah, so basically, here's the mechanic with her. You have to pick her up and bring her with which wherever you go. So get used to having her in your arms because you're going to be doing a lot of that bullcrap. All right, so we're going to avoid these bubbles because they do hurt me. And basically, what we're going to do here is... What are we going to do here? Whoa, I hear the... I hear a gold skull Tula, so I'm going to drop you here. I'm going to shoot you in the mouth. Whoops, I wasted a shot. Whatever. And then we're going to touch this. And you see those things right there? Those things are these stupid little, like, bats, kind of. They're not really bats, but, like, they act like bats. They, they kind of crawl from under the ground and, uh... They shoot up like little airplanes and stuff. I'll show you what they do in a minute. Let me. Let me, uh. Let me, uh. Oh, bitch! Let me not do that, I suppose. Let me jump back down here. This is basically gonna be used to. Yeah, see, there he is. And then you can. He's kind of a dude. His trajectory makes it really difficult for you to shoot him with the, the uh. Slingshot whenever he's kind of floating blissfully to the left or right, but We can't take Rudo with us to the other side of this, so I'm just gonna go back this way As I assume we need to be this way God, I hate this dungeon with a passion um, I kind of want to start face camming, but to do that I'm gonna have to do a whole new setup and that would be kind of annoying and for a game like this I can't really add a face cam because as you can see like all of the areas of the, of the quit it quit it all right as you can see all the areas of this game are like taken up I'm just gonna go back this way so it's not gonna be really easy to do that uh, I'm kind of lost <laughs> wasting time here where do I go shouldn't be lost this early on wait a minute is this the way I oh Jesus what have I done Jesus how horrifying what have I done where do I go this is what I was scared of how far can I throw her okay so I can throw her upwards but I can't I 
can't get that way yet. Do I need to do something else first, maybe? Ah, you son of a bitch. I'm doing very poorly. Oh my god, I just wanted to... Damn it, I just wanted to look forward. How do you do that? No, 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 can't go that way. Can't go that way, but we can go that way, but not that way. Do we need Rudo for this too? This whole episode has been just a waste of time for me to get the lay of the land. So we wind up over here, and I did not need to be here at all. God damn it. This is why I hate this dungeon. Do you see my pop? Do you see my hate now? Do you see why I hate this dungeon? I'm taking a sip of coke because I'm angry. Can I? How inconsiderate! You'd leave me behind. If you're a man, act like one. Take your responsibility. Shut up, bitch. And that's the way we wash our clothes. Fa la 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 la. Oh my god! I hit that same fucking jellyfish every fucking time. Where did I put her? I don't even. There's not a. God damn it! No, stop aiming! Quit! Son of a bitch! I'm gonna die! I'm going to die. This is terrible. I'm doing horrible. Is it here? Is this the one? Mother. Motherfucker. Motherfucker! Motherfucker. I'm completely lost. I don't know where I'm going, where I've been, what I've done to get there. I need... No, Rudo need... Oh my gosh, I'm... Whew, this dungeon, ladies and gentlemen. This dungeon. God damn it. If that... If that fucking jellyfish... You fucking hit me! Fucking bitch! Oh, wait. This is... This is the other side. Oh, uh, god damn it! Are you serious? Am I really that dumb? Oh my gosh. Alright, so I figured out exactly what I needed to do. Yeah, this episode's gonna be a little longer than usual, but... Uh, I'm just gonna skip out a bunch of the crap that I did to get to where I needed to be. You son of a bitch. Alright, so basically what we have to do is we pick her dumbass up. No, shut up, bitch. I'm done talk I'm done talking about this. We're going in here. We're gonna go this way. We're gonna son of a bitch. Use her as a projectile. We're gonna jump down here. Avoid the, the water shark guys. We're gonna hit this switch. Now I figured it out. I am so dumb! God damn, I feel like an idiot. And this is going on YouTube. How you doing, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> oh gosh. I hate this place, like, seriously. This is... This is like... A, a top worst level for me. Like, just below the water temple. I just fucking hate this level. Ugh. Stupid. Don't you fucking dare. Stop. Oh, you got... Quit it! I can't defend myself! Where's the... There it is. Alright, good. So I can... Don't you do it. Now we take her upwards. I'm gonna make some progress. I'm not gonna let this episode go on without me making a little bit of progress, because I'm pissed. I'm straight pissed. I wish you could see my facial expressions as I get pissed off because I know they're stupid. I make some pretty stupid... People have told me I make stupid faces when I'm playing video games, so I'd like to share that with you guys because that's the reason why most of you people come watch these videos, right? Just because you like to see stupid people? Okay, so now we can go this way. If I go this way, and I jump on top of this, it'll open that door. I can set her down and go through the door. And looky what we have here. Do I have the means of... I don't. I can't do this yet. You may be asking yourself why I can't do that yet. Well, shut up, bitch. 
Her face looked like her. The side of her head looks like a tuna. I don't know. It's always weird, been weird to me. Ever since I was a wee little lad, I used to look at her sides and think, "What the fuck is this bullshit?" This switch, it doesn't look like you can press it down with your weight alone, Dan. That's why I had Rudo with me. And now I leave her on top. And I go inside. And here we have a boss fight. Yes? Come out. Alright. So this boss fight consists of us kicking these stupid things in the ass. And basically... Basically, to shoot it, you have to wait. You shoot it, and then you have to wait for it to uh, wiggle because it's immune for some stupid ass reason. Die! Die! Come on, baby. Your last one standing. And I think you're gonna die today. You're gonna die today. You're gonna die today. Alright, and now we get the means to fight back. Yeah! This is not gonna be a map or a compass. It is gonna be a boomerang. <laughs> yeah, progress. Press the C button to use it as attack. Yeah, two attack distant enemies. All right, so we got the boomerang now, and I'm definitely gonna equip that. That's how you defeat the uh, the jellyfish. First you take a boomerang and put it on the C stick, and then you can defeat the jellyfish. 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 The jellyfish. All right. Sorry. I'm sorry about that. Uh, yeah. See, Rudo comes back here to uh, pleasantly wait for us. She's gonna bitch at me again, like the bitch she is. And then we're going to. I uh, know. No, you don't. You stupid bitch! I'm gonna take this girl! Only got a Rudo in my pocket! Alright, so... This is the last thing I'm gonna do for this episode because I am going a little over time and even with the editing it's gonna be a little over time, so... Let's make this a good one, shall we? Now all we have to do here is throw the boomerang at the dingly dangly and not miss like I just did. Bitch, what the fuck? Why didn't I get it? Alright, so. What the fuck? Hey, now! Play fair! Yeah! I figured you out, you bastard! Alright. Basically, what that does is it gives me another big chest. It's gonna be a map or a compass. Don't get too excited. And. Uh, basically, whatever color that thingy was, uh, you remember those little, someone's calling me, remember those tendrils that were hanging down in the, uh, one of the hallways? Whatever color tendril I just killed, it'll, it'll get rid of that, so now I can go through that doorway, and such and such, so, yeah, we got the map. This one, the map was kind of forced, we didn't, we didn't have the option of finding it, so that's, you know, that's cool, we got a map, whatever. But, uh, there's Rudo being all creepy and shit, but that's all the time I have for today, ladies and gentlemen. Join me again in the next episode where we continue to tackle Jabu Jabu's belly. Oh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be fucking awful. <laughs> A hero's work is never done. Join me again next time. Later days, guys. First you take a boomerang and put it on the sea stick and then you can defeat the jellyfish. 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 The jellyfish. The jellyfish. 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 The jellyfish. The jellyfish. Jellyfish.